actually going to start with a basic shape. So those of you in my art class know this is a technique where you start with one shape and then you refine it. So you're going to start with kind of an oval shape. And notice how I'm not trying to draw it perfectly the whole way. I'm just kind of sketching it in bit by bit. And you can have uh, your oval actually go right to the edge of your canvas so that it looks like your pumpkin is sitting right there on the bottom. to start refining it into a, a pumpkin shape. So pumpkins have these nice kind of like curved top corners like this and same thing with the bottom. So we're taking that oval and we're expanding it. We're expanding our oval. So come out a little bit on the sides and a little bit on the bottom to get more of that pumpkin shape. and just kind of go down and notice how my line isn't a straight line down. It's curving. Why do we do this? Why do we make the line curve? Alan, yes, we want to show that it's a round shape. So we have to make curved lines. Let me get a little more paint because it's hard to see. So starting at the top going down, you're going to make some nice curved lines going down. Stem, it's easier to do at last. But. Pretty easy. The only tip that I would give you that you probably aren't don't know at this point is using the flat side of your brush. So when you start to get close to your pumpkin with your background, that really flat edge of your brush is really good for edging and getting close to your pumpkin but not actually covering your pumpkin. So really take your brush and use that edge to outline so that when you get closer with the black paint, you're not going over and covering up your beautiful pumpkin. Okay. 